All right, what is going on guys and welcome to another video. Today, we're gonna to be talking about a new acne treatment that is on the market called Sebacea that promises incredible results. This is a picture after 24 weeks of one of their test clients showing a pretty significant improvement in before and after. So I wanted to look deeper into what this treatment is. It involves gold particles and some lasers, all sorts of crazy stuff. So in this video, I'm gonna to explain to you what it is, but we're also gonna dig deeper into the actual study results and what you can kind of expect from this and if it's worth your money and how much it costs all that kind of stuff so stick around is sebacea worth your time can it get rid of your acne let's go All right, we're about to go hot right into this topic, but first I just wanna mention, I just opened a Discord for this channel so that you guys can come in there, talk with me and everyone else in the community about acne, skincare, all that kind of stuff. You can have questions and answers. You can just chat with other people who know what it's like to have acne. Use the Discord link in the description below. It's freaking awesome and I just started it. So I really, really, really appreciate it if you get in there. All right, now let's get into this. Sebacea, what is it? So Sebacea, just to put it super simply, basically they're rubbing gold particles onto your face using a vibrating massage gun type of thing to help it get deep into the follicles, the sebaceous glands, this is what they're saying. And then they use a laser, specifically a YAG laser, to activate those particles and then that basically damages your sebaceous glands, which then is supposed to inhibit their functioning. So cause your sebaceous glands to produce less oil, which then leads to you having less acne. So I went onto one of the websites that offers this treatment, and this is what they had to say about the treatment. The treatment is comfortable, convenient, and consists of three short 30 to 45 minute treatment sessions over two weeks. After each treatment session, there is no downtime and you can return to school or work. Then they say the Sebacea treatment works by delivering a formulation of gold microparticles to your skin, which are then heated with a common dermatology laser, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera basically all the stuff that I just told you. Okay, so of course, now that we kind of understand what it is, the first thing I wanted to do is see what it looks like when they actually do this. So I looked around YouTube and found an actual procedure video of a doctor applying this to somebody. It is gold microparticles. It's a black solution that we put on the skin and we massage it in with this massager. And then we do a laser and we do three treatments, three weeks apart, quick, easy office visits. And it's putting people's acne into long-term remissions. And we are so excited to be able to offer this treatment and you're about to see the uh, particles applied massaged in and the laser treatment so you'll see how easy it is to put your acne into long-term remission with sebacea and this is just the gold solution which happens to be black but those are gold particles and it's being massaged into the face and we do the entire face and we're gonna go over the face basically three times and the eyes are covered so that nothing gets into the eyes Actually, it looks like a needle, but it's not a needle. It's a blunt tip. So it just makes it easier to drip the solution out. And we're gonna go over the face three times, then we're gonna wipe off the excess. Um, but there'll be a little bit of the solution down each tiny hair follicle, which goes into each oil gland. Second part of the Sebacea treatment, FDA approved for acne, we're gonna use a YAG laser and laser the patient's face, which is gonna activate those gold particles that are sitting in the oil gland and shut down the oil gland. Okay, so when I saw this video, it kind of made me uncomfortable because this doctor, I mean, she is a doctor, she does procedures on people every day, but she literally says that by using this laser, it activates the gold particles in the sebaceous glands, which then shuts down the sebaceous glands, which then stops acne. I don't know if she's just trying to oversimplify it, or if she doesn't understand how stuff works. I'm assuming it's oversimplification, but you don't shut down sebaceous glands entirely. That's, that's that, that wouldn't work. Your face would be like a dry, like an ashy desert. Like that's just not what this procedure does. It's not really what anything does. The point of this procedure is to inhibit or slow down or reduce the activity of the sebaceous glands so that you produce less oil. That way your overproduction of oil that a lot of people have that have acne is is lessened and then you have less acne. But it made me kind of uncomfortable. She just said, it's gonna completely stop your oil and then stop your acne. Okay, so naturally after I found out about what the treatment is, saw it actually being administered by a doctor, then I wanted to see, are there any videos where people have actually gotten the treatment and what their review is. So 
I did find a couple, but the ones that I found were a little concerning as well. Uh, this first one, uh, this girl says that she, she got the treatment four months ago. Yeah, just take a look at this. We are four months in, and that three to four month mark is honestly, even they were saying six months in, is where you really start to see the best results from the treatment. Your skin starts to have a nice clean complexion, it starts to settle down, and honestly, very true. Very, very true. I definitely, in the very beginning, was a little bit skeptical on how my skin was gonna react to it, and now that I've had a chance to settle into it, it's great. I mean, I'm still getting some breakouts, but those are more hor hormonal. Those are more hormonal. The sebaceous treatment doesn't necessarily cover hormonal acne. It only covers sebaceous glands. Okay, uh, this again made me kind of uncomfortable because, you know, this girl, she's not a doctor or anything like that. So I'm not trying to be too critical, but she is saying that sebacea does not intent to improve hormonal acne. It is only supposed to help sebaceous acne. And, and again, I, I feel like maybe someone just didn't inform her who was administering it or something, but hormonal acne is sebaceous acne because all acne stems from oil coming out of your sebaceous glands. Hormonal acne is just the cause of you then overproducing oil out of your sebaceous glands. So that kind of made me a little bit skeptical. And then I listened a little bit more and then she, you know, specifically shouts out the clinic that did this, which to me kind of sounds like she did a little bit of a partnership with them, which to me always kind of sounds like, you know, people skew their results to sound really positive if they're getting free treatments for it. So after I saw this girl's video, then I was, I was like, all right, let's look for another person's video. I found another girl's video who details, uh, I think she covers two different treatments, but she basically shows the multiple treatments as well as what her face looks like right afterwards, kind of red and inflamed and stuff. But then again, with this girl, she actually in specifically like explicitly says thank you so much to sebacea for collabing with me so she literally is sponsored by sebacea again another one that i can't trust what she's saying because she's in partnership with them again i just want to say thank you to sebacea for you know collabing with me on this and letting me get these treatments i'm so so excited. I will have everything linked down below if you want to go check out Sebacea or Sonoma Dermatology for yourself. So go check the description box. Okay, so at this point, I was kind of getting a little tired of going through videos and just seeing people over and over say that they were, you know, paid or just in partnership to do this. So I was like, all right, let's just get down to the brass tacks. Is there any scientific studies that cover Sebacea that prove that it is as effective as they're trying to show it? Um, so I did find one study and in that study, it says this. At 12 weeks, the mean absolute inflammatory lesion count decreased significantly by 14.3 in the treated population versus 5.1 in the control population. So what they're saying right there is that uh, after administering this treatment, they had 14.3 on average less pimples, basically lesions. Uh, and then people that didn't have the treatment at all had 5.3 less lesions, uh, which is kind of interesting. I don't know why those people's went down if they weren't doing the treatment, but basically they're showing that it's about three times more effective than, than the control group. Now, one thing that I always do whenever I see studies, especially studies that show really positive results for new acne treatments is look who funded the study, look who's sponsoring the study. And this is something that, you know, in, in all industries, you can always look at who the donors are of a study and then you can kind of be you know skeptical or not as to the results because you know if you're getting paid as a researcher you are going to try and produce the results that the person paying you is trying to achieve with the study so at the bottom i found this this research was sponsored by sebacea duluth gadp etc uh, are employees of and or have financial interests in sebacea akjl and rra have consulting relationships with sebacea i'm not trying to drag this treatment i mean hopefully someone out there who's watching this video can give us your results of what you you know you saw in your own skin before and after doing this treatment but just looking at what i'm finding here. I get so excited talking about new treatments. If you guys watch the channel often, you know I just talked about Win Levy, which is a new treatment that a lot of people are very excited about. If you haven't seen that video already, I'll put it in the top right corner so you can check that out. And that one did seem like it had some really promising results. It seemed like people are seeing some pretty good reviews from it. It did seem like there's science behind it and it didn't seem like it was skewed. 
Just saying. And when I looked at this, I heard about it and I said, that's very interesting. It sounds very novel. Rubbing gold particles into your face, which, you know, I was like, that's interesting. But then the idea of shooting lasers to activate those light uh, receptive particles to damage the sebaceous glands, uh, that kind of made sense. Like it might actually work out. But I just got less and less excited as I kept peeling out more layers of this. Again, I don't know. I don't know anything. I'm just presenting to you what I found after researching this for a couple of hours. So the last thing that I always do is, you know, you go on YouTube, you look, a lot of times people are content creators, so they, they might have partnerships. You, you have doctors who a lot of times get commissions because they're working with the actual company. The research studies like we found are sponsored by the actual company. So I said, what about, you know, people who are just putting up the reviews and there's no incentive to them to either say it's really great or really bad. So I went on Reddit and here's what I found from Reddit. First off, I wanted to know about the price because they didn't list the price on any of the official websites, which is pretty common, probably because they don't want to scare people away. In this Reddit comment, I saw I've read on different price points ranging from 1600 up to 2400. So right there, it sounds like for the three treatments, it's going to be about 1600 to 2400. Now, when I looked up what people's results are with it, it wasn't really great reviews. I, I honestly had a really hard time finding anybody who said, this is fantastic. It's awesome. It works really well. Other than, like I said, the people who are making videos who are influencers. Here's what I saw on Reddit in the comment section. There's still no results and it's about two months out from the treatment. And then with a follow-up comment a couple of months later, it is now Thanksgiving and my daughter has had this done in July with zero results. Sorry to say, I think we wasted our money on Sebacea. I do not recommend it. The reason that this one was really interesting to me is that on the websites, it does say that it can take anywhere from two to six months to see the results. So a lot of people will sit there and they, they don't know and they're kind of waiting. And with this from Thanksgiving until July is about seven months. And she was basically holding out, hoping that it was gonna help her daughter. And it looks like it didn't give her any results. Now, another kind of kind of weird comment here I found on Reddit is this. I wanna try this, but when I contacted a clinic here in the UK who were a part of the original trial, they said they dropped the treatment because the results were disappointing. Again, another comment that doesn't inspire a lot of confidence in me. Uh, I'm just presenting what I found. So after going through all of that, do I think that this is a promising treatment? It looks less promising than when I first look at it. Do I think that this is a bad treatment or that it absolutely will not work for anybody? No, I think it still could end up being useful. Maybe they need to refine it. Maybe it's only useful for people with a certain type of acne, maybe super mild. I did find in the study that they said they only tried it on people with very mild to moderate acne and anybody who had moderately severe to severe acne, they did not accept them into the study. So they are aiming for that more mild acne. But again, not seeing any reviews where people are really stoked about it. Now this treatment is relatively new. It, I, I believe it's only two years, three years old. I think it came out in 2019. I try to keep my ears to the street when it comes to new acne treatments because I know it's really important to you guys. And I know for me, like when I had my worst acne, which if you haven't seen already, I'll put it on screen. I had really severe cystic acne. I was trying anything and I was willing to try anything. And so I know, covering these new treatments is exciting because there's more things than ever to try. And there's so many different avenues that a lot of people have seen improvements with some of these new treatments. So I think it's important to flesh them all out. And sometimes I find ones that don't seem so great after hearing the initial, you know, explanation of what they are. And I still want to share them with you guys because I don't want to just share the winners. I want to share the ones that I'm skeptical about too, because maybe you're going to hear about this, or maybe you're going to go into a clinic one day and they're going to say, Hey, have you tried, you know, Sebacea? Have you tried this gold particle thing? It's going to sound really cool. Just like it sounded cool when I first heard about this but now you already have a little bit you know of knowledge about it and you can say hey I haven't really heard any good reviews about this and you can kind of you know go in with a little bit more of an informed decision on another note if you guys are dealing with active acne right now and you are trying to figure out what you can do for your acne I worked on an acne program for over a year and I released it just recently it's called the acne method and I've put through a couple people on the acne method and they've had really really solid results I personally use the, the method myself and when I'm on point with it it definitely helps me control my, my breakouts it features over 60 scientific studies so it's based on science but I also made it really easy to digest 
really easy to read through and it really can help you a lot. It's only 10 steps. It's only 10 bucks. I want to make it affordable for everybody. So definitely check that out. I think it'll help you a lot. It's theactingmethod.com. And now I want to know what you guys think about this treatment. Does it sound like a scam? Does it sound like the truth? Would you try this? And really, really, it would be awesome if anybody's watching this video who has actually done this treatment, please let us all know what you thought about the results of it. And I'll pin your comments so that everybody can kind of see that. Put it in the comments below. And there we have it guys, another video. I just wanted to do a deep dive research on this topic. I'm definitely willing to change my opinion if more information comes out, if more studies come out, if more results come out, if more people are saying that it actually worked for them. But I just wanna to present to you what I found because I think it's important for all of us. So if you enjoyed the video, give it a thumbs up. It helps get out to way more people. Subscribe for more deep dives on new acne treatments. If you have a treatment you want me to cover, put it in the comments below. Subscribe if you're not subscribed already. Hit that notification bell so you get all the new videos. And remember, you are not alone. You are beautiful and you're part of Team Acne. I'll see you skin bosses in the very next video.